You open it up. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Candace, and I just want to say thank you for stopping by. Today is my last day of summer vacation and I walked through the door to find a ton of mail on the counter. Some of it's mail for my classroom, some of it's mail for me, but one thing in particular came and I am so excited to show you guys. It's my second month of Lit Joy Crate. I'm so excited to open this for you, so I decided to do an unboxing right away. If you haven't seen my last Lit Joy Crate video, I'll link it in the bottom bar below. I'm not really sure what theme it is this month, so I'm really excited. I have no idea. I've not opened it. This is my first time opening it. I just broke the seal with the scissors. All right, so you open it up. Oh, this is what it looks like right here. Oh my gosh, guys. I think this is a unicorn. How cute is this? So it is a legendary quest theme. Super Slug of Doom is the name of the book. So this is the card that they send you that lists everything in your box and gives you a little description. So the book is called Super Slug of Doom. This is Blossom the Unicorn. Blossom the Unicorn. I love these little like crinkled paper. By the way, if you watched my last video, I had no idea what it was called. And I went into Hobby Lobby today and saw like the craft section and realized that you can buy a machine that crinkles paper for you. And yes, I knew that, but I just have never seen it before. So I learned what it was called today, right before making this video. So it was fate. It's called crinkled paper. But this is Blossom. Oh my goodness, she could be the cutest little mascot in our class this year. My coworkers might make fun of me, but hey, once my kids see this box, like I'm gonna, by the way, the way that I'm gonna do this in my classroom is even though I've received this box at home, I'm still gonna take it into the school and act like I've never seen anything before. I still wanna build anticipation with my students to make them excited about reading and I just want them to be able to see how I'm excited about reading and maybe that will kinda put some good vibes about reading in their lives. Sorry, I also have a dog and I don't want him to eat the crinkled paper. <laughs> so, okay, I'm gonna go through the box and just show you guys what's inside, guys. So Trevor the Mushroom, I don't know what that is. Oh yes, I do. This is Trevor, this is Trevor the Mushroom and I think he's a light. There's a potion of power packets, strawberries and cream marshmallows. Okay, Willie Winston. Yep, you got him. Okay, so this is Willie and we're not gonna let him eat crinkled paper. He just went to the groomers today. Isn't he handsome? It changes colors. How do I get you guys to see the change of colors? Like right now it's blue. I need to move the lights. You guys see it? Yeah, blue, and now it's changing to green. This would be a really cute idea to keep at your small group table. A lot of the teachers like to use a light to let the students know that they are working with a small group and not to bother them. Um, this could be my light at my small group table to let my students know that I'm working with other students and that they need to ask three before me or whatever procedures we're gonna put in my classroom. Oh my gosh, hello, Trevor. Potion of power packets. I don't know if that's this, but no, these are the strawberries and cream smash melt. No, sugar-free Hawaiian punch, sugar-free Hawaiian punch. Oh, this is the smash mellow strawberries and cream. These look delicious. I'm actually going to try some. So Blossom, which is the name of the character. I'm guessing she's a uh, name of the character in the book. Blossom never undertakes any quest without trust and tasty bag of marshmallows to keep his energy up. Oh, it's a boy unicorn, that's good to know. Just be careful not to eat an entire bag right before you need to run up a great mountain so you can save an entire forest. It might slow you down. Smashmallow is a premium snacking marshmallow made with organic cane sugar and all natural ingredients. Nice. Cool, they come in little, little squares. Hmm. They taste like a strawberry marshmallow. So, if you like strawberries, and if you like marshmallows, here you go, nice little snack. This is a slug. Sticky slug in bug jar. Okay, so my jar was broken, but I'm assuming it came like this. This is a sticky slug in a bug jar. Brave hero, are you prepared to capture the evil slug Zorgoth and keep him from reaching the potion of power? 
Use this magical bug jar to capture him before he destroys the super happy magic forest. Each transparent jar has a magnifying lid for a better evil slug viewing. Enjoy stretching your sl sticky slug and teaching that evil Zorgoth a lesson. So it's, oh, it does magnify. Oh, what a great teaching tool. Okay, so we got another letter from the author. Again, this is the name of the book, Super Slug of Doom, A Super Happy Magic Forest Story by Maddie Long. So I am gonna read the author's letter to you guys. Dear Hero, today is a momentous day. You are about to embark on an epic quest with five other heroes, but do not fear, they are professionals. Everything is going to be fine. All you have to do is journey all the way to the top of a mountain and stop an evil slug from drinking a very powerful potion. On the way, be careful of rickety mine carts and fire spewing dragons. Oh, and the hungry ogres. Don't let eat, don't get eaten, please. Otherwise, you won't be able to party if the quest is completed. Remember to take your time. They are called epic quests for a reason. Nice. Maybe I should be calling like our lessons epic. Qu oh no. Oh no. It became a dog toy. Oh no. Blossom. Blossom is not a dog toy. This is not yours. Willie started to play with him. They are called epic quests for a reason. Willie, no. Can you find the lost things that have been hidden on some of the pages? I know this quest is safe in your hands. Good luck, adventurer, Maddie Long. And then all of the cartoons are there. Like Zorgoths is saying bad news. Mwahaha, I cannot be stopped. And um, what's her name? Oh, I keep thinking it's a girl because his name is Blossom. But I am in love with the cover of this book. This is so cute. Super Slug of Doom, A Super Happy Magic Forest Story by Maddie Long. I'm not going to read the book because I really hope that you decide to get your own LitJoy crate. I'll link the website in the bottom bar below and I hope you guys decide to get one for your class and to open it with your students so that you can instill the excitement of reading within them as well. So that was everything that came in this Lit Joy Crate box. I'm very pleased with this box, just like I was the last one. I'm definitely looking forward to my next one. This theme was Legendary Quest. So I think there was a common theme between the teen and young adult books that you can purchase through Lit Joy Crate. Definitely love the Legendary Quest theme. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I would love for this video to reach more teachers so they can get an idea of using Lit Joy Crate in their classrooms. Please subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see any future videos, and I will see you guys in the next one.